In black and gold, he weighed in 139 and one half pounds, and in 10 professional bouts, has 10 victories, all 10 wins coming by way of knockout. Here's the undefeated super lightweight from Dallas, Texas, Virginal Ortiz Jr. Once again, referee Vic Dragulich with the final instruction. Center of the ring. Not All right, gentlemen, this fight's scheduled for 10 rounds. You received your instructions and directions. Again, I want to caution you. Any punch below this point will be called low. Golpes de bajo de este punto serio mal bajo. That said, I want you to obey my commands, protect yourselves at all times. Obedezca mis comandos, su proteger se su mismo siempre. Touch them up now. Good luck to both of you. Buena suerte, Alfred. Suerte. As we are underway, Virgil Ortiz Jr. in the white trunks, 10-0, 10 KOs. Most of those have been devastating knockouts, taking on Roberto Ortiz Massa. This is his nickname, everybody calls him that, out of Torreon, Mexico, 35-2-2 with 26 KOs. Massa is a short name for Macizo, which means he's solid. That's the nickname they have. We will see against young Virgil Jr., but Virgil is considered to be one of uh, Golden Boy Promotion's brightest young prospects. Uh, and we're seeing that they truly believe that by matching them, by matching Virgil against somebody as experienced as Massa uh, and his previous opponent, who was a former two-time junior lightweight title holder, uh, Juan Carlos Salgado. And that was just in June, and he ended that fight in the third round. Quickly, and that was a, a headliner of ESPN, so Virgil Ortiz is now headlining ESPN, he's here fighting pay-per-view. Uh, he doesn't talk much, this young man. This is a second fight with Robert Garcia, and he attacks. He, he was a main sparring partner of Jose Ramirez, who won an excellent fight last night against Antonio Orozco. That was a sensational performance and a great effort. Uh, a sensational performance by Ramirez, but a great effort from uh, Antonio Orozco. So in the Robert Garcia Boxing Academy in Riverside, Virgil is sparring a who's who in that camp. Also had Brandon Reels that he sparks with. At times he's gone with Mikey or Garcia, Robert's younger brother. Can't get any better work than that. On a daily basis, that's what he's getting. Before that, Virgil was training with Joel Diaz, where he served as Lucas Matisse's main sparring partner. That's true. And pretty soon it's going to be... Virgil Ortiz, who's saying, oh, I barred with Virgil Ortiz. That's what's going to be happening, too, the way he's going. More body shots. He sits on his punches really nicely, does Virgil Ortiz, at Grand Prairie, Texas. Started his career at Vivero Boxing Gym in the Dallas area. Garcia's got him really working a hard jab. I'm seeing more straight punches from the outside from Virgil than I have in previous fights, and I like what I see. I like that straight left to the body. Virgil's a fighter who made his pro debut at Canelo Smith at Cowboy Stadium when Oscar De La Hoya at a press conference said, this kid's going to be a future world champion. And the, the way Oscar said it, the way Virgil reacted was, yeah, like, matter of fact, we are. It's a lot of pressure on a young fighter, but, but he doesn't think it's pressure. Virgil says, yeah, why not? That speaks to his mentality. And he was 18 at the time. <laughs> Ringside in Las Vegas, the T-Mobile Arena starting to fill in. Later on the night, it's going to be completely sold out, jam-packed. Rockers, just like... The weigh-in was over 5,000 people lined up and got into the weigh-in. Now goes Ortiz. Beautiful shot right here. Four, five, six, Ortiz. Siete. He was a right Ocho. man. Come here. There you go. You okay? Yeah. Walk to me. Okay. Walk. Virgil smelling blood right away. Hey, calm. Virgil Ortiz in the white. 10-0, 10 KOs, will he make it 11? Oh, back with a body shot for Virgil. Ortiz goes down for the second time in the round. He felt the stairs, he felt in the body.
body. Cinco. Seis. Very wise of the young man Siete. to attack the body. Ocho. You gonna stay down? Nueve. Wobbling right at nine. Jay Nathan, come here. And it's, all, it's over. A second round stoppage for Virgil Ortiz Jr. The hot prospect from Grand Prairie, Texas. Yeah,